What is up guys? Blim here. We are back with more showdown live action and today we have an insanely powerful team which we are gonna be using in the high sword and shield OU ladder. So we have a team based around like absolutely six broken mons and yeah I think that by using this team you can easily easily climb to like top 20 or top 10 in the sword and shield OU ladder if you like play good. This team is so strong that rarely will get a bad matchup firstly yeah you will rarely get a bad matchup versus any playstyle. Yeah this team just absolutely shits on stall yeah it's very very easy to beat stall with this team. This team has a good matchup versus most balanced teams and this team has an insane matchup versus hyper offensive teams as well. So yeah so today we are going to be using this team to play some games in the super high sword and shield OU ladder. So let me show you the team real quick and the concept. Let me explain the concept. So I so choice bundle Mel Metal is the strongest physical attacker in the sword and shield meta right now. Yeah, I mean there is card, but card I mean card is just card just has its like attacks. I mean card just has a strong attacking stat, but yeah, card's moves are weak. Regigas is, isn't used. Haxorus isn't used. Landris offensive Landris isn't used, but still. This mod has only its attacking stat, like high attacking stat, and look at this Mel Metal. Not just one for the attack, attacking stat. This mod has some super duper powerful moves, like Di Bash is an insanely powerful move, super far very powerful, and it has got both elemental punches. And not just that, this mod gets Iron Fist. Now, what Iron Fist does? It boosts your uh, punching attacks to 1.2x base power. So stab Di Bash gets boosted, and it has a chance to flinch. Ti uh, T punch gets boosted, Ice Punch gets boosted. Yeah, and all these three moves get boosted, and when you at this choice band and this monstrous attacking stat this one has yeah this one has the strongest among every other mon in the sword and shield OU tier with its stab i mean cart has very weak stabs like deep blade is super duper weak smart strike is like pathetic so yeah cart is a strong attacking stat though but still like this mon hits harder than cart so we have an insanely powerful mel metal and also we have one of the mon which doesn't have a switch in, in the sword and shield OU tier right now nido king <clears throat> yeah and Nido King, we have amazing coverage. We don't need Flamethrower because we have, yeah, we are not weak to, like, Flamethrower only hits, like, Corvin and Ferrothorn, and we are not weak to Corvin and Ferrothorn. <coughs> we have a lot of stuff for Corvin and Ferrothorn. We have Knock Off, uh, we have Knock Off Tornadoes, we have, yeah, T Wave, Di Bash, uh, we have Thunder Punch, and even Ice Beam does a lot to Corv, <coughs> and we can always burn it with Flow King. So, yes, I think you need all these three moves and superpower. It's really good for those Blisses and stuff running around, and even you can superpower hits Ferrothorn for a lot of, lot of damage. He is a stupid wrong. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, we have an uh, we have a Nido King, and the only one con of these two strong attackers is that these attackers are kind of slow. I mean, Nido King has a decent speed here, but yeah, these two attackers are kind of slow. So uh, I think like uh, I was running like minus attack, right? <laughs> Let's run like minus attack <laughs> because I don't think like we are gonna be facing a lot of blisses. But the ideal is to go minus speed up. But don't think we're gonna be facing a lot of blisses. So yeah. Huh? What? Oh, okay. Screw it. Three or four. Okay. Yeah, and then we have a we have a pivot. We have a pivot in the form of tornadoes. Yeah, tornadoes, Tyrion. This one, yeah, as I as I yeah, you, you might have you might see me using a lot of torn because like this one is absolutely amazing in the sword and shield OU tier right now. This one is the absolute god one in the tier right now. It has not only does it have this the most broken ability in according to my opinion regenerator absolutely broken this mod has got amazing stats like look at these stats you just i mean this is like god gifted stats you have this insane amount of speed even without like investing you have a super duper high special attack and you have a really really decent attacking stat even without investing so this mod like this knockoff it does damage it tweet kills more it tweet kills like yeah it tweet kills like resisted mons it tweet yeah and this U-turn also it hits it's hit hits Lele and stuff for a lot of damage. Like U-turn does like 30% to a Lele. And Hurricane, it, it's a it's an Oko on Katana always. Yeah, it's an Oko on Urshifu. So without investing this mon hits hard. This mon takes hits. This yeah, this is my signature set, and this mon is EV to take Greco Meteors from Dragapult. This one hits in, insanely hard. And we have a U-turn pivot as well. You can U-turn and bring in your attackers. And the best part is this mon it, it doesn't care about status. Like if this mon gets burnt or poisoned, I mean Para can be a bit annoying. But this mod is a status absorber so this is really nice and then we have a uh, one more pivot slow king the evs are incorrect i don't know why this evs gets resetting for some, there is some bug or something this evs gets reset keeps resetting oh well so yeah we have a pivot slow king a standard pivot slow king because our main check to tapu lele and stuff so yes and of course of course we have uh, the 
I think this is the best physical wall in the game, and this is my signature EV buzz wall. In this one, yeah, it doesn't die. It takes aerialists from bandit cards. So yes, that's all you need to know. And this one cannot get cannot be killed by normal physical attacks unless like you are running a brave bird, a strong brave bird mon or like a acrobatic solution. But I have even seen this mon take acrobatics. Let me just show you some calves. How much acrobatics does? <coughs> Paulusha unburden sweeper. I don't know why they keep this item as grassy seed. This should be like no item. Yeah, none. And then I have a first wool. I will import the team. I will import the team. Physical wall. So let's see. See, this is not my buzz wool, but this acro has a 50% chance to oko. So let me use my buzz wool. I think my buzz wool has 240 defense. 240 or something along those lines. See? See, acrobatics has a 12.5% chance to kill you and this ice punch does a lot of damage this ice punch does some insanity amount of damage so yeah you're good Halucha can be a bit of a problem yeah Halucha can be a problem but but it's manageable it's manageable because like slow king <coughs> slow king leaves a hit from full uh buzz wool as i showed you buzz wool might live depends on the Halucha set and even like yeah tornadoes and you can like sand chip it down and the best part is Halucha doesn't get a free setup on any mon yeah, if they try to set up on the theta, you can like T-wave them, you can even rock blast chip them and after like a defense drop, you can easily beat them with your buzz wool or a slow king. Yeah, you can call them. So yes, but yes, uh, Holucha can be a can be a small issue. So yes, and yeah, so this is the team, a very, very powerful team which you can use and if you like play well, you can easily, easily climb to top 10 or even like go for top 1. So yeah, let's get some games using this super powerful team. let's see what we get <coughs> and we are super duper high in the ladder as i said we are like close to 1900 so let's like uh <coughs> watch up watch some battles like 1500s which oh, a lot of games are going on 1500s okay <coughs> let's watch this guy yeah it will take some time chancy rain <coughs> like how is this chip supposed to work yeah you got your shit so we go for the toxic okay okay Oh, this is that, yeah, this is that team by, I forgot the name, Dragon Claw, yeah, the Dragon Claw team. This team is like, it, it's kind of decent, but it's not that very good. It's, it's decent though, it's decent. Okay, we got a game versus a uh, very, very fat, balanced kind of team. So, so So yeah, they hit up with a V-File, like, I do not want to stay in on a, I, I'm pretty sure they're not click the knockoff, but I think when I have a free switch into my Buzz Wool, why do I need to risk it? Yeah, I know they were gonna go for the knockoff because all these kids do is go for the knockoff for no absolute reason. But I don't care, I can like, uh, <clears throat> I think they're gonna double to the clef if anything. So I can like pull a double to my tone and get a knockoff. I think they're pretty sure doubling to the clef here. Yep. <clears throat> That's pretty easy. Now, yeah, potential like a sticky barb. I, I mean, T-Wave can be annoying. Leftover, I think it's T wave. Okay, knocks off. Okay, this is like a. I think this is a rock set. Thought so. This might, rock, this, this might be a rock set. But yeah, I'm, I'm not worried about this rock because I can defog on a lot of stuff. So yeah, let's defog. And the moment I bring in my Nido King, he is in a world of trouble. He's in a world of pain. I can like defog this shit away. Goes for the moon blast. Guess the drop is annoying, but yeah, I think I can like. Uh. uh I can hurry can I know I know we, I know which turn to screw him yeah click turn go to the Nido King yeah, he goes for the now now yeah sludge wave is hellishly free now but you know what I think I'm gonna click the sludge wave because he might strain and go for the knockoff but if he goes to the balloon train it might be a bit annoying he goes to landy okay this is hella this is like that this is like a max speed of landy yeah he goes to the weevil yeah this weevil takes a it takes a huge chunk of damage uh, I think I can like double to my uh I think I can double to my, I think he's triple axling if anything. I can double to my theta to give it more sand chip. Give it more sand chip. <coughs> I don't mind, I think I don't mind this Weavile taking damage at all. I don't mind this taking damage. Or yeah, I, should I keep my theta? I think that this Dragonite can be an issue. Um, but yeah. Buzz wool. Uh, I'll just double to the Buzz wool. Double to the Buzz wool. 
see what he does. Yeah, I should have clicked the sledge wave. But no, no need to risk for anything. Five. Yeah, it does like zero. See, it did zero damage. I told you. I can like go for a free roost. Because the packs, I don't mind the packs at all because it gives me a free kill. T spikes, okay. Let's like uh, TP out. I want to TP out. Go to the club fable. Okay, perfect. See, I bring in my threat again. So if I, I'm clicking the sludge wave. No, and there's not a not a single other move I'm clicking. Uh, and I think I can like click the. If it, I don't mind. I don't mind. See this Weavile, yeah. It, this Weavile is taking this huge chip, so I don't mind this at all. Uh, I wanna like. Uh, uh, I wanna keep this uh, D uh, T type for the D knight. Yeah. So whenever he goes to Pex, I get momentum. That's the thing. And this Pex, yeah. It, 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 T spike. I mean, T spike doesn't affect my team only. T spike doesn't affect my team. He goes to Tran on my. I hope you're like a uh, offensive ish kind of something. Magma storm. Okay. I can TP out. Free TP. Free TP. Yeah, to go to the Weaver. Oh, perfect, perfect. Yeah, now we get our like. Uh, I wanna bring the DI Basher and straight up smoke him. I wanna really wanna do that. But you know what? I'm gonna give him Sand Chunk. When you can give him Sand Chunk, like give him Sand Chunk. No need to worry a thing. I prefer to have my Melmetal's item get knocked off here. He goes to the Pex. I don't mind the Pex at all. I wanted my Melby's item to get knocked off, but oh well. I mean, this T-Punch will do a lot of damage, but I, I don't want to risk anything. Yeah, because like he's going to give me more momentum. He's going to give me more momentum. See, he's taking the Sand Chunk. See the Sand Chunk? He's taking this. And yeah, I can just go to my Nido King, get my T-Spikers off, because I my boots are knocked off. And here, I again get a switch to my Buzzingtons. He goes to Tran, okay? So I think I will go to my T tar. He misses the magma. He misses the magma. Unfortunate. Pretty very unfortunate. Uh, let's get my shits up. Perfect. 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 Yeah, let's EQ the crap out of him now. I don't think he's staying in though. I don't think like I can take T wave. Yeah. It's perfect. Perfect. Yeah. This is so good, man. I'm getting T waves on the cliff is just amazing. I so wanna go to my basher here. I wanna go to my basher, but I think uh, this might be the rocky helmet pack, so I wanna don't wanna do that. And this is why I'm gonna go like. Uh, I don't need my life orb as well because like yeah either way it will like do some insane damage. Yeah, I don't need my life orb as I said I don't need my life orb at all because like it will do regardless it will do a huge chunk of damage and see this land is getting chipped for no reason oh wow this is like a hella speed of d-knight I can like kill you off yeah he gave us a huge threat to the team and see already messing up already he's getting messed up oh, I thought like you were like a bandit something you were like a bandit shit okay he goes to the weavile again ah uh, I, you know, if I, if I want, I can like sack my Nido King because like future side into like uh, DI Bash just wins me the game, but I don't need to do anything like that. It's like Earthquake is hella free. And whenever he goes to the cliff, he goes to the Tran. As I said, I don't mind the Tran. Like he's Magma Storm Protect, Earth Power, and Taunt, so I don't mind. And yeah, the T Tide will always like come in on it. Uh, let me just flex click the flex click the rocks here. Flex click the rocks. I'm so stupid. I'm absolutely stupid. I should have got uh, like a rock plus damage. I'm so stupid. Let's go to my Torn on his potential defog, okay? Free knock for me. Yeah. I don't know why this why these idiots just stayed on the I told that day only. I told that day. Like don't stay in, don't stay in on a torn with your Lando because you are not gonna see he's got his Lando chip for no reason. He goes to the Tran, which again I'm gonna like chip it down and I'm gonna get my shits up again on you. You can do crap. You can just watch. Yeah, it does like zero damage. I don't think still it will kill. It it, it it's still out of range. My heat uh, my uh, this one is still out of range. Uh, yeah, this landy will take like yeah damage. Can my Nido King is yeah see he took damage for you. Yeah, I think it dies. It dies. Yep, it dies. Offensive heat trend dies. See first six so oh, absolutely yeah, and he was super. I can already tell he was super high in the ladder. See, I can already tell by his playstyle he was super high because he made some really good pivots with the Weavile and the landy. But as I said, this team is like it's super duper powerful. Let's get the next one. Yeah, egg smoker got absolutely smoked. We smoked his eggs. We got a game versus this guy who is using a. Uh, he's like double fairy, double steel, double fairy, double steel team. So my uh, Melmetal looks super duper good, but okay, this is gonna be super tough to break down. Like my Melmetal has to be my key to break down this team because this took, it looks extremely difficult to break down. Lead off with my turn on the Tapu Koko. He leads off with this. Okay, I don't mind you. I can like knock off. He oh, he calls next turn. This is the best part about tornadoes. See. Torn, yeah, I can go to you. Okay, let's like we just. Ah, he doesn't threaten my sloping at all. Let's TP out. He went for the TP as well. 
So you know what? If I go to my theta, it's gonna drag in the scum, and I can like, uh, and if he goes to the landy, he's gonna take like yeah, he's gonna take the chunk. He's gonna take chunk. So I wanna go to my theta because I want the uh, scum story to get broken. I want the scum story to get broken, and like if he goes to the coco, yeah, he's gonna take the uh, yeah coco can't threat threaten me at all unless he's like banded U turn. That might be a bit annoying, but yeah, his team is gonna be tough. Yeah, as I said, as I said, I don't wanna take a like a. I don't want to take like a. Yeah, he goes for the rocks. I don't mind. I can like free default. Oh, he's toxic as well. I think this helmet. Okay, I don't mind because like yeah. Okay, no problem. Like we got we got what we needed, right? We got what we needed. So why is it lagging though? Uh, I think like he's gonna like if anything he's gonna like uh, TP here. Yeah, but he can't threaten me with anything. Nothing threatens me at this point. Nothing threatens me. I'm not even worried about that Coco. So let's see what he does. Wow, nice. Uh, yeah, TP. He's gonna toxic me if anything. Yeah, I I saw thought told this is like a toxic spamming team. So I can go to my Nero King. I think he's going to the slow King, right? I wanna sludge wave this. I still wanna click the sludge wave because I think like yeah this uh. uh uh, it will like uh, tweak your the sloking either way. 32. 32. I think this is running some speed. I wanna calc. Landers, theory, and defensive. Let's import my team real quick. Because I think he's running some speed. Wave does 30 to 36. 30 to 36. It took 32. 240 to 52. 25 to 28. Oh, this is running. Has to, this has to run some speed, right? <clears throat> I'm thinking. Like, is he trying to pivot to the is he trying to pivot to the slow king? You know what? Let's let's calculate the speed. Let's calculate the speed tiers. Oh yes, hell yeah. Ah, uh, let's knock you off. Oh, uh, see, 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 we got so much momentum now. I can like turn out, get more chip turnout, and if I can like go to my uh, I think uh, let's put the Buzzingtons on his turn. He knocks off my boots. Okay, I can like punch him in the face. Club Fable, I think this is like a calm mind something. I think this might be calm mind. Let's go to you, Moonblast, yeah, free TP, Slow King, perfect, perfect. Now he knows. Now, now, let's get my T Tar in. Get my Tatar in and I wanna like uh Rocks hurt him a lot, right? Yeah, let's get my shits up. <coughs> oh, let's like uh T wave the scum. Oh, this is so freaking good man. This is like insane, insane, insane. I don't mind, I don't mind the scum at all. I do not mind. I actually I do mind because like it's annoying. Uh, because he's gonna get the rocks up, right? He's like toxic, he's toxic stealth rock, okay. Super toxic scum. Okay, let's go to my Nido King because we can default. Oh, he goes for the body press. Perfect. So uh, I wanna like sludge wave the incoming slow king and do a decent chunk of damage. Uh, is he gonna TP out? Okay, slack off. Perfect. Which side? What does he go to? If I like knock off, is stealth rock? Why is it toxic scum? I've never seen a toxic scum in my life. Landy, okay. Uh, he can knock me off. Let's go to my town. He turns to Coco. Cran. A free turn for me. Go to my. Yeah, he does like zero damage. Let's like get my shits up. Okay, this is an earthquake. Go to the scum. I want you to go to the scum. Go to my Nido King. He gets his shits up as well. I wanna like click the uh, sledge wave. I'm gonna click it again. 39, really good damage. <coughs> so let's go double back to you. Future side, why not? And his Tapu Koko doesn't kill me with any move at this range. You do not kill me with any move, I'm pretty sure. Unless you're like Bandit Wild Charge. Nice. Okay, nice. Okay, now this will hurt. Now this T Punch will hurt. 
should I click the DI badge? But the land, oh, the land will die to future side if he goes to that. The land will take rocks and future side damage. We are good. Yeah, this is the future side is coming. He will get hurt by future side. This will lose a decent chunk. Yeah, dead. Drop, drop, drop. I don't want to take a body press at all. I do not want to take that because I can. Like, when I have a fevered, why do I wanna? Yeah, let's TP out. Do you see? Do you see this? Do you see this? Do you see the pain we are giving? Him? Do you this? Do you see the sheer pain we are giving him? Yeah, just like I, I don't need to pretty crap. Just sludge wave, sludge wave, sludge wave, sludge wave. Don't need to pretty crap. One crit, yeah. This low king is just waiting for one crit. TP is out. To what? To what are you gonna TP out? To what? You do not threaten me at all. You do not threaten me. Go to that. You go to that now. Yeah, T punch is uh, T punch is super duper free. You don't have a switchy to T punch at all. Yeah, you are gonna take super duper damage. You are gonna take some super instant damage. Yeah, seventy. See, got wrecked. Got absolutely jacked. This calm. And let's go to Nido King. He rules up. Yeah, I can like uh, sludge wave. Slow King. Yeah, see, he's losing. He, yeah, see, he's losing HP per turn. Let's go to us. You, yeah, see, free, free future side. Yep. How long? How long can I do this? He cannot. He cannot keep continuing this. He cannot keep this. He cannot keep doing this. Yeah. Now let's like TP out. <coughs> Wait, I misclicked almost. And I can like uh, yeah, T punch. Or do I click the heat run and go for the? I can switch out. Died. Yeah, it's dead. It's dead. Yeah, it's over. It's over. It's absolutely over. As I said, he, he cannot. He had a he had an instant matchup though. He had a very very good matchup. He had a stupendous matchup, but he absolutely screwed up. And I can just like, yeah, I can like T wave you. As the easy to cover calm mind, I can like T wave this crap. And yeah, it's in like yeah, Mel Metal is gonna Mel Metal is gonna eat this alive now. Mel B is gonna eat this alive. Yeah, I just wanna TP out. He knows, he knows, he knows what's happening at this point. And I'm pretty sure even my Nido King will like eat him up. Nido King will eat him up. But I wanna like let's let's not let's throw a DA bash. On the scams, right? The scam is there. Uh he, he's gonna switch out. Let's the T punch. Oh, it does it does way too much damage. It does super duper ton of damage. It does way too much damage. <laughs> It does way too much damage and yeah he ran he absolutely ran so just yeah two six o's two six o's absolutely smash the two six o's yeah see all these are super duper ladder players look at this guy and i'm pretty sure this guy oh my god look look at this guy this guy was in 1853 1853 let's just get one more game yeah, let's get one more game how much are we at 22 yeah let's get one more game and this has to, this has to be the strongest uh i mean i this team is like top right up there in the in those master masters team this team is like, as I said, this team has a good matchup versus almost every team. See this, yeah, he had, he had a good matchup though. But as I said, this two, this wall, this this combination, Melmetal and Nido King, this, yeah, if you can play this, like, yeah, with this two pivot mons, just it does wonders, it does wonders. Only problem I said is gonna be Holucha. Oh, there is only one problem, Holucha. But still, it's still, well, I mean, Holucha has to struggle to like uh, get up Source Dance and stuff because it doesn't get a free SD on any mon. It, it cannot set up on the buzz wool. It cannot set up on slow king. It cannot set up on Nero king. It cannot set up on Titar. It has to like either kill Titar or yeah, if it's set up, it's gonna get T wave dot. Yeah, it's gonna get rock blasted. It cannot set up on Torn. Torn is gonna destroy it. Okay, we got a game versus. This looks like a. I'm, I'm not sure what, what to expect from this guy. I think it's a Mew lead, if anything. I think it's a Mew lead. <clears throat> Just like Torn him. Oh, perfect. Just no. Are you counter? If this counter bro, I'll be really sad because I, I let's U-turn and get okay, perfect. Go to you, uh, <coughs> uh let's get my like sheets up. Tita is an absolute menace. Tita is a menace in the tier right now. It's no one uses it, but it's super duper good. Yeah, see it he can't, he can't move, he can't even move. Let's go to my Nidoki, which is kinda useless here. Oh, it's life of max special attack clip. All, yeah, this is why I like to like pivot. I like to pivot, but still, Nido King is. I mean, he has got decent ball. I'm assuming this is a max, max special defense. Oh, oh, this is some life up crap, I guess. What? Oh, you are the like the okay. I get okay. You are the oh, I, I okay. You are the dangerous set. Okay, nice. Titar, 
defrosted when it's up yeah this is the dangerous set it's like the body press uh, okay i get it uh let's exchange t waves lum i mean this works though i don't mind he is like uh, okay he is like a resto chesto uh, and my mel metal should like deal with him now it's double to the mel b okay yeah this di bash is going to die if he stays in is going to die oh i doubt you beat me i doubt yeah look at this damage though i doubt as i said i doubt you beat me it's going to do like zero damage yeah it's going to do zero damage smacked 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 he goes to zap what are you going to do to me though i doubt you can do anything to me Yeah, he heat waves me because like I can like TP here on his. Hmm, I'm thinking. I think future side is a fine play. Now we TP out. Because we prevent the Gengar from coming in. Yeah, this is a max special attack Zapdos. He goes to the Club Fable. Okay. Yeah, then now I get a. Now I claim something. I think Sludge Wave is a free claim. Yep. Sludge Wave is a free claim. <coughs> Yep, Zapdos also so died. I mean, I'm super. Don't get me wrong. I'm mad scared of this Alakazam. It goes to Gengar. Okay, Gengar. I mean, Gengar can be an issue. Uh, let's go to my Thorn. It goes for the 58. I want to see your scout. I want to see your scout. Tornado Stadion. What is this cap bullshit? Tornado Stadion. Custom set and. Gengar, choice scarf, shadow ballers, thirty nine to forty five, and like uh, choice picks, fifty four to sixty eight. How much did you do? Fifty four. Yeah, this is the choice picks. Okay, nice. So we get a free U turn to my Tyranitar. I think this shoots up. I'm super duper scared of this D knight. This D knight can potentially sweep me. Club Fable. Okay, let's go to my Nido King. I think he's trying to get, desperately get up the rocks. I think he's trying to do that, desperately get up the rocks. Oh wait, wait, his life up. Wait, 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 I'm full. Oh, his. Oh, I forgot his life up. More, more. I forgot his life up. More. I absolutely forgot. Like I want to like Earth Power him. Because it's a it's a throw. Earth Power is a throw. But yes, I I throw. I like throwing. It disables me. I don't mind because like my this job is done. My yeah, this this most job is done. The worst thing would be like if this one gets up a nasty plot. That's gonna be really bad. So I want to sludge web this. Live. Perfect. Perfect. Amazing. Amazing. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Why? When you can preserve something, preserve it. Club favor. It's like a future site. I think it's T bolt as well. Oh yeah, yes. Yeah, trying to get up the rocks. Slack of ones. Oh yes, oh yes, I thought so. TP out. Ha! Huh, I have a. I am so much scared about that D night. I am mad scared about that D night. I think this D night is gonna sweep me. I think this D night gonna sweep the crap out of me. Ha! Huh, how do I not lose the D night? I I can't help it. I I'm thinking I lose the D night. I'm pretty sure I lose the D night. He's gonna DD up, I guess. Oh, you're gonna take a lot of damage, bro. You're gonna take a lot of damage. Oh my God! Kill the net through the scale. Kill the net through the scale. What? What is this bullshit? Ah, uh, let's try. Let's even keep the six o. Let's. Oh my God! It's a throw, you know. As much as I wanna keep the six o, but if it like nasty plots, I may straight up lose. So. Oh, it's so! <laughs> it killed a Dina in the morning skill. GG. <laughs> six hours after six hours, it's raining six hours. It just rained six hours. The strongest team in Sweden will know you. Six hours, six hours, six hours. All super high level players. All are eighteen hundred, nineteen hundred, like top level players. All top ten players. I know this guy. This guy, yeah, this guy is in high level always. This guy is like top ten always. This guy, yeah, these are all top a uh, strong player. Tournament. These are these are an all top tournament player, and yeah, this guy also. Just smoke three six o's, three body bags, body bag. As I said, this is the strongest. I can like bet this is the strongest Sword and Shield team, uh, Sword and Shield OU team ever built in existence. This one, as I said, this team. I have been working on this team for I think one point five years. I have been working on this team, and finally, 
this team has turned to take shape but as i said this team is kind of weak to flying spam it this team is super duper weak to flying spam i mean not just flying spam i mean you have you resist flying spam but the combination of like flying versus flying to ground flying to like uh, uh fighting uh, as i said like denied with dual wing meter and earthquake can cause some problems but most denies are running like ice punch and earthquake so yeah you are good versus them because buzzwool walls even plus six denied with ice punch and earthquake and only one threat you have holucha holucha is a threat but if you but you know what i can make some changes to take care of holucha just make this just change this looking to a slow bro and make it like a speed up slow bro and you are good versus holucha as well just make this a speed up slow bro and you are good versus holucha i mean i might try that but yes what an amazing team and an amazing life so yeah this should be it for today guys the super duper strong team the strongest team in sword and shield you use this team and i'm pretty sure you can like reach top 10 just like in a flash in a flash see as i said i played and the, the 36 was started from 1866 and i landed up in the 1900s yeah, 1911 pretty easily just like that all six was all six was versus like three insanely strong players so yes this should be it for today guys for more amazing sword and shield bdsp all sorts of old gen like sword and life content subscribe to the channel leave a like on the video and most importantly guys stay safe guys bye bye take care guys